Welcome back to Ayaz Tech. In this video, I will show you how to create and set up MetaMask wallet to use blockchain technologies and to receive and send your payments in blockchain like in Ethereum. If you want to pay in Ethereum and receive, receive the Ethereum payments or other currencies, then you can use the Meta, MetaMask wallet. So let's begin. It is very simple and easy process. So before we begin, please make sure that you have subscribed to my YouTube channel and clicked on the bell icon. So let's begin. Uh, we will open the MetaMask website that is metamask.io. And here uh, we have to uh, click on the download button. This will, uh, we have uh, three uh, applications. One is the Chrome extension. Second one is the iOS application and sec third one is the Android application. So in this video, I will show you how to uh, create account and uh, set up your wallet with the help of the Chrome extension. So just click on the install MetaMask for Chrome and click on the add, Chrome, add to Chrome button. Wait for it and it is installed and after you have installed the metamask extension it will open this page in front of you so uh, it is saying welcome to the metamask and here you have to click on the getting started here it will ask you if you are new to metamask so if you already have an account then uh, you can import your wallet by clicking on this button and it will uh, give you option to provide the secret recovery phrase and a new password to recover the, your account but if you uh, if this is your new account and you are doing it for the first time then you have to click on this button yes let's get set up this will create a new wallet and secret recovery phrase for you so click on the create a wallet button and in this page it will give you some information like uh, uh, it will it, it is saying that metamask will always allow you to opt out via settings send uh, and uh, it will send some click and page view events and it will never collect keys and things like that it will never collect your full ip address it, it will never sell the data for profit ever etc so you can read it next uh, if you want to agree then click on the agree otherwise click on the no thanks and now click on the i agree here you can you have to create a new password for your account now click on this i have read and agree to the terms of use you can read it if you want to read it normally mostly mostly people don't read it but you can read it if you want so click on the create button okay now it is uh, uh, giving you some information like uh, secure your wallet before getting started watch this short video to learn about your secret recovery phrase and how to keep your wallet safe so this video uh, would be helpful for you to get some knowledge that uh, what is the secret uh, recovery phrase and how to keep it safe so i would recommend to watch this video for you so it is also giving giving you some written information like what is a secret uh, recovery phrase your secret recovery phrase is a 12 word phrase that is the master key to your wallet and your funds and uh, uh, it, it is also giving you suggestion how do i save my secret recovery phrase it is saying that save in a password manager store in a bunk vault store in a safe deposit box write down in and store in multiple secret places so you should save your uh, recovery phrase in so many places so uh, in this way in case if you lose access of one uh, 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 place of your password location then you can recover it from other place so in this way uh, it is better to keep uh, your recovery phrase in multiple places because you might have uh, a lot of uh, money in your wallet and you don't don't want to lose it so this is the best way to save it so 
you, should I share my secret secret recovery phrase? No, you should never ever share your secret recovery phrase, not even with the MetaMask. If someone asks you for your recovery phrase, they are likely trying to scam you and steal your wallet fund. So don't share it with anyone. Now click on the next button. In this page, it is uh, uh, providing you the secret recovery phrase. Your secret recovery phrase makes it easy to back up and restore your account. Warning, never disclose your secret recovery phrase. Anyone with the phrase uh, with this phrase can take your either forever. So don't share it with anyone. And uh, there are some tips uh, like uh, store this phrase in a password manager like 1Password. This is a, a very useful tool called 1Password. You can save your recovery phrase there as well. Write this phrase of a phrase on a piece of paper, store it in a secure location. If you want even more security, write it down on a multiple piece of paper, store each in two to three different locations. And you, sh you should also memorize this phrase if possible. And uh, now here, uh, if you, you should click on this button, uh, this link, and this will download the key phrase like this in your computer. And now after it is downloaded, you should save it in a, uh, somewhere in a safe place. Now click here to reveal the secret words. So these are the secret words. These are, this is the recovery phrase uh, that you have to save. It is, the same phrases are stored in this text file. Now click on the next button. Now it is asking you to confirm your secret recovery phrase. Uh, please select each phrase in order to make sure it is correct. So for that, click on this file, open it and uh, compare it and add every word in proper order like in your text file to confirm it. So let's do it that. Start. Park. Hand open. Rely. Fatigue. Answer subway and man athlete and duty gun. Okay, now click on the confirm button and congratulations, you passed the test. Keep your secret recovery phrase safe, it is your responsibility, responsibility now. Tips on storing it safely. Like it said before, save a backup in multiple places. Never share the phrase with anyone. Be careful of phishing. MetaMask will never uh, spontaneously ask for your secret recovery phrase. If you need uh, to backup your secret recovery phrase again, you can find it in your setting and security section. If you ever have a question or see something fishy, contact their support here. MetaMask cannot recover your secret recovery phrase, so you have to be very careful and keep it in a safe place so you, uh, because you cannot get it again if you lose it. Now click on the all done button and you can read about what's new and click on the close button. Here you have your, your new account and a new wallet is ready to use and active now. So. Yeah, so this is your account name and uh, this is your account uh, wallet ID. Uh, if you click on this, it will copy the wallet ID. This is your wallet ID. This, this is your wallet address. So whenever you want to receive funds on the, your wallet, you have to provide this uh, wallet address to them uh, to receive the funds. And uh, here you can see all of your assets. Uh, right now we have zero Ethereum in our account. And in this section, you can see that all of the activity of the transaction that you have done so far. From this button, you can buy, You from here, you can send some Ethereum and you can swap. Other than that, you can rename your uh, account name as well. And for example, here, if you click on the uh, pencil icon, it will allow you to rename it. Uh, okay, so we have renamed the account now you can all if you want you can create multiple accounts So that is very simple and easy just click on that and click on the create account 
and here you can add any name for example i want to type investment and click on the create button now we have two total accounts this is the investment account and uh, this is the personal account you can create as many accounts you want and you can keep the funds separately in uh, every account so other than that in the settings section you can configure anything according to your own preferences and uh, in the security you can uh, if you lost your secret code and you want to get it again and you uh, your session is still active you just come here and click on the reveal secret recovery phrase it will show you uh, the phrase again but for that you must have to provide the password to continue and click on the next uh, it has shown us the uh, recovery phrase again so that's it so i think that's all for now i wanted to show you in this video this is very uh, helpful and easy to use if you have any questions or uh, if you want to share something then please don't forget to uh, mention that in the comment section and also please subscribe to my youtube channel if you like my video thank you for watching see you next time